Good morning. It is Sunday, May 2nd. Can you believe how fast time is flying? Yesterday, we began the month of May. Today, it's already May 2nd. <laughs> Just a little time flying humor there for you. But you know what? It does fly pretty fast. We're born, and before we know it, we're teens. And before we know it, we're middle-aged. And before we know it, we're retired. And before we know it, we're gone. We are here on this earth for a short span of time. Oh, it might seem long to us, but the, in the eyes of the Lord, it's a short span of time. And so every day of our lives, whether we live short or long, needs to be lived for the Lord. Because this earth, as I have said so many times, is not our ultimate goal. This earth, if you will, is just our holding place. And once our mortal bodies perish, we are called to the Lord to be judged. And at that judgment, it will be determined whether or not we live with the Lord forever. Many people say that the choice is going to be ours, that our God who loves us so much and is a just judge will ask us if we want to live with him forever, and he will give us the choice. And it seems ludicrous to think that none of us would choose to be away from the Lord, yet if we live our lives away from the Lord, why would we choose him? Why would we not instead say, no thanks, I appreciate the offer, but I've got everything covered on my own? If we have no time for the Lord in our earthly lives, there's no reason to think that we would make time for the Lord for eternity. And what a loss that would be. And so toward the beginning of this month of May, we ask our Mother Mary to watch over us and to guide us as a mother would, to encourage us and to continue to point us to her Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you this day and every day of your lives.